Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name's Gavin. And in today's video, I'm gonna be going through over 100 Christmas gift ideas for your list this year. These ideas are targeted towards teenage boys, but can be definitely used for anyone. You'll find the ideas I give you have a wide range of prices, and a lot of them do have alternates that are more budget friendly. Keep in mind, these are recommendations. I'm not forcing you to buy any of these, okay? I have broken this video into seven categories, and they are random, technology, music, fashion, hygiene, room decor, and experiences. Let's just hop right into it. We're gonna start with the random category. Number one are Lego sets. It may seem like you're too old, but these are honestly so fun and I really enjoy making these. Some sets I recommend are the Millennium Falcon, the Infinity Gauntlet, the Eiffel Tower, the Titanic, the Colosseum, or Hogwarts. Some of these sets are like insane. This is such a good gift. Number two is a doorway pull-up bar. Number three is dumbbells. It's definitely an easy way to have weights at home without buying like a big barbell and a ton of weights. Number four is a gym membership. Now, unless you're asking for this or you know it's something maybe your kid is interested in, I would not get this as a gift for someone because it could be taken as an insult. Number five, card games. Card games are so underrated. I don't play them too often, but when I do, I'm always like, wait, this is so much fun. Some I recommend are Uno Flip, Clue, We're Not Really Strangers, and Cards Against Humanity. Clue's kind of a board game, but like number six is a massage gun. I definitely recommend Theragun Mini. I have that and I keep it in my track bag and it's like perfect. Number seven, puzzles. My sister loves puzzles and she just like does them for hours. Number eight, card holders. I love these because they can be as expensive as you want. You could get like a basic one for Amazon. You get a freaking loot. Louis Vuitton card holder. And that also holds true for number nine, which is wallets. Number 10, Stanley Cup. Stanley just had their like huge viral moment on TikTok. I love Stanley's. Personally, I keep mine in my car because it like fits in my cup holder, which like none of my good water bottles do. So this is perfect. And I try to drink one whole before going to school every day. Just like keep me hydrated. Number 11, a skateboard, a longboard, or a penny board. If you're like super coordinated and think you can handle a skateboard. Number 12, disposable cameras. These are always so fun because you can like take them with your friends when you go places and you never really know what you got. So like it could be awful, but that makes it even better. Number 13 is a real film camera. And number 14 is film for that film camera. Number 15 is gift cards. Gift cards are a great gift because like one, you don't need to like use it right now. And two, you don't have to leave it in the hands of someone who might mess up what you want. The next category is technology. This is definitely just a pricier category overall, so keep that in mind. Number 16 is a MagSafe portable charger. If you have an iPhone, these connect onto your phone. They're super good. I have one from Apple that I got two years ago and it like still works really well. I know Anchor also has a good one. Number 17 is a Spotify or Apple Music subscription. This is nice because you can do like a yearly gift card. It's just like a full year subscription that comes in a gift card. The iPhone 15 just came out last month. Number 19 would be iPhone cases. Obviously, Apple makes great cases. Case of and Wildflower are also two brands that I really like. 20 is a wireless charging station. You can basically like have these on your nightstand and it just charges everything. Number 21 is the MetaQuest 2. Number 22 is a projector. Fun to put up in your bedroom, especially if you don't have a TV in your room. Number 23 is a Roku stick. These work really well with projectors and you can get like all the streaming services like on one, just like plug into the projector. Number 24 is AirPods. I think the most recent ones are the threes and then they also have the pros. The pros have really good noise cancellation and then the threes are like just as good, they just don't have noise cancellation. 25, an alternate to AirPods Beats Studio Buds. Number 26 is Sony Link Buds, which is very similar. And then number 27, AirPod Maxes. I would recommend to get AirPods over AirPods Maxes if you're deciding between them. They're just like more versatile in general and have really similar audio quality. I would go with the AirPod Pros. Number 28 are Beats Studio Pros. This is like an alternate. If you want like over the ear headphones, they're really good. And then Bose Quiet Comfort are also really similar. Number 30, Netflix, Hulu, or Disney Plus subscription. Number 31, Bed phone holder really random but like you like clip it onto your bed i'm someone who loves watching movies before i go to sleep and i don't have a tv in my room so like this would be perfect for me number 32 playstation or xbox number 33 games for those playstations or xboxes number 34 a bluetooth speaker some brands that are really good are jbl wonder boom harman kardon and marshall number 35 nintendo switch number 36 ipad there's the mini the pro and the air my siblings use the ipad air in college and they all really like it i have the ipad pro and i really like it too if you're looking for something you're gonna use for school, I would definitely recommend the Air. Number 37, Apple Pencil. Number 38, iPad Case. I have like a really funny Minion one. Number 39, Polaroid Printer. These connect to your phone like with Bluetooth. Number 40 is a Polaroid camera. Number 41 is a Kindle. These make reading like so easy. You don't have to lug around a bunch of heavy books. Number 42 is a Kindle Unlimited subscription. If you're an avid reader, they have so, so many like thousands of titles available. Number 43, MacBook. So because I have a YouTube channel and have to like edit videos, I have the Pro. But if you're gonna use it mainly for school, I would definitely recommend the Air. 
hair. Number 44 is an Alexa. I don't want to trigger yours um, because I know that happens. So that's why I whispered it. I have an Echo Show. I know the dot is really popular too. Number 45 is a camera. The Canon G7X is a really good option if you're looking for like a vlogging camera. And it also takes really good photos and it's pretty portable. The M50 is another great option. That's what I'm filming on right now. 47 is an Apple Watch. I have the Apple Watch SE. I think they're on like the Series 9 now, but the SE is definitely like a more affordable option. And I still have access to like everything I need with the SE. Number 48 is a Garmin watch. I know these are really popular with like my running friends. Now we have like a pretty small category just for music. So number 49 is a guitar. I got a guitar for Christmas last year and I literally play it all the time. I didn't know anything about guitar before and it's like super easy just to like pick it up and start doing chords and stuff. Number 50 is an electric guitar. Number 51 is an amp. Number 52 is an electric keyboard. A piano is just not something that's a realistic gift. Number 53 is vinyls. I love collecting and spinning my favorite albums. 54 is a record player. This is another gift where you can like really decide like what price range you want to go in. Like there's more beginner record players and there's like really expensive like crazy ones. And number 55 is a DJ set. I feel like this would be so fun. Like honestly zero use like realistically but I think this would be so fun. The next category is basically just like fashion. So clothes, shoes, accessories. Number 56 is baseball hats. I love myself a good old baseball hat. Definitely recommend Urban Outfitters and PacSun for these. Number 57 is the North Face Puffer. Number 58 Casio watches. I think these are so simple so like honestly timeless. Number 59 is an essentials hoodie. Number 60 is just a basic hoodie. This is from Abercrombie and Fitch. This is like my favorite just like plain basic hoodie. Number 61 is a polo bear tee. Number 62 is a Stussy hoodie or tee. Number 63 a mad happy hoodie or represent hoodie. Just two like general higher end like streetwear brands. Also just like a random hat. What I do for like brands that I like but like maybe I don't want to spend that much money on it. Go to like their Instagram and press little plus button and like it'll show you like brands like it. Number 64 is a new pair of sunglasses. This is like really versatile because you can get like a cheap pair on Amazon or like Urban Outfitters or you can go for like a higher end like Ray-Ban or Oakley but either way they look super cool. If you are gonna like ask for a more expensive pair I would definitely go into a store and try them on because sunglasses are a thing that can like look really cool online then you put them on your face and you're like these actually look really stupid on me. 65 is Urban Outfitters or PacSun graphic tees. I think these are just two brands that like make good graphic tees. BDG jeans is number 66 which is Urban Outfitters. Jean brand honestly these are my favorite jeans. I have so many jeans that I wear like non-stop from BDG. 67 are the Carhartt double knee pants. Another like similar pant is the Abercrombie like loose work pants. Number 68 are beanies. Again, Urban Outfitters and Paxson have like really cool beanies. I'm so excited for it to get colder outside. I know it's October when I'm filming this, but like when it gets colder, oh, I'm so excited to wear beanies all the time. Number 69 is a Patagonia fleece. These are so comfy. I always like overheat when I'm in school with mine on because I'm like, this is just too warm. 70 is a Carhartt beanie. Number 71, workout clothes just in, like in general. Some brands I recommend are Gymshark, New Balance, Nike, Aloe, and Lululemon. Number 72, pajamas. I was gifted pajamas for Christmas last year. I think they're from Walmart and I literally wear them every day. I have worn them all year. They are Christmas themed, but that does not stop me. Number 73 is artist merch. Number 74 is sports teams merch. And 75 is a sports player jersey in particular. Number 76 is Nike socks. Every year, I feel like we just need a few new pairs of Nike socks to replace the old ones that have just like torn or just been like really dirty. Number 77, Uggs. There's so many good like varieties of Uggs. I have the Numos, I think they're called. The Tasmans are obviously really popular. Number 78, Adidas Sambas. Number 79, New Balance 2000 Rs. Number 80, Adidas Forum 84. Number 81, Converse. Number 82, New Balance 550s. Number 83, Jordan 1s. Number 84, Nike Dunks. Number 85, Yeezy Slides. This is something that you can like really easily just like find a dupe. Number 86, Golden Goose Superstars. Number 87, New Running Shoes. And that's it for the fashion section. This next category is one of the most important ones. It's hygiene. Number 88 is just a really good moisturizer. I have really oily skin. I use La Roche Posse Double Repair something. I'm not a dermatologist, so number 89 is a good cleanser. Again, research like what's right for you. Number 90 is cologne. I use the A.B. Crombie and Fitch Fierce Confidence Cologne. I think it's like a lighter scent and more affordable cologne as well. Number 91 is Blue de Chanel Cologne. Number 92 is YSLY. Number 93 is Mont Blanc Explorer. If you do want to go for a pricier cologne, this is also something that I recommend you go in store and actually try out the smell because the last three colognes I listed are like pretty pricey. So you could be paying like over $100 for three to four ounces. You want to make sure you like it. Number 94 is an electric toothbrush. Number 95 is teeth whitening toothpaste. I definitely wouldn't recommend you use this toothpaste like every day, twice a day, just in the morning or like every 
other day just because it's like bad for the enamel on your teeth number 96 crest whitening strips again don't use that every day number 97 is ordinary niacinamide serum this is for like oil control i'm asking for this for christmas because i have really oily skin number 98 is the ordinary hydraulic acid hydrating serum number 99 is a tongue scraper this gets all the bacteria off your teeth and makes your breath not smell as bad number 100 is the therabody mouthwash i see always see this on tiktok number 101 is native body wash number 102 pimple patches i use these i don't know if they work i feel like they don't number 103 is an electric razor and that's it for the hygiene section which starts our room decor section number 104 is just posters nobody likes bare walls Number 105, custom rugs, okay? There's so many cool rugs that I see on, like, Pinterest and stuff. 106 is a fun desk lamp. Urban Outfitters has a really cool, like, mushroom one. Number 107 is a globe light. Soft lighting, I think, can really, like, transform a room. I have three lamps in my room, and I always feel better when they're on. Oh, no one likes overhead lighting. On the other side of that, you can get LED lighting. So, LED strips is 108. I have some behind my bed frame, and it makes this cool, like, black glow effect. Number 109 is a clothing rack or pole. I have a clothing rack right there, and I just like, I don't know, I think it ties together my room really nicely. Number 110 is just a mirror. This could be like a round mirror on your wall, a full length mirror. Number 111 is vinyl shelves. You can like hang up vinyls on your wall. Number 112, just shelves. Number 113, fake plants. Number 114, neon signs. You can get cool customizable ones. I have like a planet one that I used to put on all the time. Number 115, glass music frames. You know, like the Spotify things where it has like the Spotify code. Number 116, cool shaped candles there's like bubble candles twisty candles not candles one friend got me a middle finger candle once i don't know what i was saying but i was I'm like just gonna use it so now it just looks like a hand there's no finger up anymore but i mean that's my fault number 117 is led light panels number 118 scented candles these are more like functional than visual but can be so nice for a room that smells bad 119 oil diffuser number 120 is a sunset lamp and number 121 is a star projector the last category is experiences this is a pretty brief category category 122 concert tickets look up who's in your area concerts are so fun okay literally like my favorite hobby ever comedy show tickets is number 123 number 124 a podcast tourist so if you have a podcast a lot of times these podcasts will like do tours will like do live shows number 25 touring musical productions so tickets to those number 126 tickets to a professional sporting event number 127 is a college sport ticket honestly i love college sports i think they're so fun to watch more fun than watching professional sports in my opinion and then number 128 is a massage massages are so underrated okay and that wraps up this video i honestly might do a part two a little closer to christmas so definitely subscribe and be on the lookout for that i'm gonna try and link most things in the description if you like this video give it a thumbs up if you didn't like it give it a thumbs up and if you're a parent watching this video thank you for watching and i hope your child loves their christmas presents and if they don't please don't come back to this video and be like why did you tell me to get this for my kid he hates it see you in the next one